Previously on the Sorry Girls, when we last left you, we were here at my boyfriend's mom's property in a small lakeside town in the Okanagan where she has been renovating these nine boutique motel units. We're here for just five days and we need to fully transform and decorate these spaces. <laughs> it's a little weird. So we've been given the one bedroom that has a Western theme going on. Okay. We could make this work. We took the term cowboy and ran with it. We can't turn it off. We're now considering the possibility that this wasn't meant for a light at all. That doesn't make any sense, but I'm gonna be real sad if we have to take that down. Well, we have to tackle the bachelor unit in something that resembles a tropical paradise. I'm excited for this though. It's a good challenge, because last time we had the one bedroom. What if we paint the trim? Ooh. No. Lord, your vision. I don't think he's very happy that I wanna paint. He leaves the room like he's doing it himself. I have no idea what I'm doing. Come on, we're on a timeline. We only have a few days to finish this. Let's go, let's go, let's go. No way. That was Elliot, he's on our team. <laughs> Okay, tell me where you left off yesterday. We had some electrical struggles, which was really stressing me out, but I think I got news that that all got fixed last night, which is a huge relief for us. Yeah, so we can continue on where we were. I finished tiling, and obviously now it's like grout and a bunch of other things. I Not as far as I thought I would be on day three. This is the beginning of day three. That's right, there's a lot left to do. Do you have a lot left to do? Yes. But I feel like I have more to do that I haven't even thought about yet because I've seen the amount of work that you guys have been bringing into your unit. I don't know what you're doing yet, but like I've seen things happening like tiling. Like we're tiling, we're tiling now. I didn't want to tile, just it, it chose me. So now I have to I have to come up with some sort of tile equivalent. No, you don't. You have an extra bedroom. That's your equivalent. Okay, and something else that we want to do is think about the guest experience. Have you been thinking about this? I've been thinking about the fact that it's on my list. Have I come up with a plan yet? No, I have some of an idea. Do you? Which reminds me, thanks and sex for sponsoring this video. <laughs> okay, we're back. And I think some good news has happened. Yay! We've got a working light switch. That's good because she's a cutie, I still love it, and I'm glad we get to keep it. What do you want to start with today? Painting? Oh, painting. you're so prepared. Let's well, do it. Well, I gotta find some other stuff, but it's getting pretty close. I like it. Are we painting the baseboards? Yeah, that's my vote, because we're gonna do a half wall of a nice, like, deep red vintage color, and then, yeah, it'd be weird if that was, like, a white trim. And what about the outlets? Just take the roller and just... Oh, yeah. Easy. Okay, make sure you get paint, like, in there. Makes a better connection for when you plug stuff in. Sorry, girls cannot endorse this message. <laughs> Whoa. That's brighter than I thought. Well, it dries darker, I think. Do we still like it? <laughs> should I do it? No, you should not do it. What do I do now? Wipe it on the wall. I'm painting it anyways. It's actually a good test. It's very, yeah, it's a very vintage red, which is nice. I like it. It looks really good, the wood tones. We want to grout, but I think I need to do that last because I don't want to do a home hardware run now. I want to do that later. So first up, I think we should get our blinds on the wall as our accent wall feature. And then honestly start bringing things in just so I can see what we really need before we do any kind of shopping. Shop once, figure out what you need twice. Here you go. Oh my gosh, okay. You didn't even pretend to catch that. I don't know, you think you're actually gonna throw it at me. Okay, now we need to figure out how to put them on the wall. They're just wood now, they're not blinds anymore. My thought was to cut the height too, but I will forfeit that in the name of... Expediency? Ex expediency. Basically the process is measuring out the features on the wall, marking them out on here, reinforcing the back with duct tape so it doesn't unravel, and then cutting out the wood. Let's give her a shot. I'm nervy. Okay, 
Okay, so we have this dry fit. I think that's what the kids say. Get my glasses on. I don't have glasses. Get, don't worry, I'll do the hard work. Get my earplugs. Do you want earplugs though? I got lots of those. Okay, now we need to figure out how to use this. I'm only used to using the electronic ones. Wow! So we get this up, we can decorate, and then we take files. But oh, that's not how this works. <laughs> that's, there's a lot more to do. There's about three steps left. Nope, I wrote them all down. There's like 30. Yeah, but you need to be too detail-oriented. We just found this on Marketplace. It's one thing we haven't found yet, and it's the closest option I can find. What do you think about this rug? Is it on theme? I would like something a little more themey, but I haven't found any rugs in any thrift stores. This one is brand new. He's asking 110 for it, but I think we could haggle, haggle a little bit since it's been up for a while and I can come get it today. Did you find this paint can just here? Black yep. paint? Yeah, it's called Grand Piano. That's awesome, it's like brand new. It's trim I also. probably should have used a paintbrush. This is kind of difficult to get get in these grooves, so. Yeah, but I that go. doesn't leave paint. <gasps> My Dolce & Cabana shirt. Yeah, your shirt has a tiny black speck. I got red paint all over my pants. It's a DIY lifestyle, baby. <laughs> um, this is great. This is perfect. Hi there, do you sell the hooks to hang a guitar on a wall? Yep, we do. Okay, perfect. I will be by later today. Perfect, sounds good. We'll see that. Thank you, bye. Perfect, perfect. And that music store is right by where we need to pick up the rug. This was all coming together. Honestly, looks good. Weird hack, honestly. But um, okay, our wood is up. Annalise actually was heading to the hardware store anyway, so I said, "Hey, girl, can you give me some grout?" And she said, "Okay." So grout is on its way. Until it comes, why don't we? Maybe start bringing in some stuff just so we can see where we're we at. Can you sweep first? Yes, you may sweep, sir. I really want to refinish this tabletop with something stone. Or tile it. <laughs> so I have this chair option, but it's black and dark. Would love something colorful. I think I saw something in the barn. It's not even a barn. I don't know why I keep calling it that. <laughs> They're under there. I'm really confused right now how that one has like a sloped arm and that one has a... It's called fashion. Look it up. I'm hungry, I'm sorry. Okay, let's, let's take him to the unit. I kind of like them. We already got them. If we find something that's like less mid-century modern, I'd be intrigued, but we have these as an option. What are you working on? I found this chain from the lights you took off of the wagon wheel. Oh. I'll put it on here, and then this guy is just gonna hang. What? From here, something like this, and then I'm gonna put it up there. That is mad resourceful. What are you thinking, like up here? Yeah, on that, on that beam. Genius! It's genius! It's not just my good looks. <laughs> you got a little more going on. Just a little bit. <laughs> just gotta bend this little guy here with the limited tools we have. That looks good for the bracket height, and then we can uh, adjust the chain. chain. Yeah. That's better for sure. Way better. If you hit your head on it, you're just too tall. You're too tall. You shouldn't have been that tall. Goodness, you can't stay here. You're too tall. Yeah, you're just too tall. Got the grout. I think that Elliot's actually gonna take his first stab at grouting while I walk into town. There's some thrift stores that are within walking distance. And we're gonna see if I can pick up some of those pieces that we do need. Oh, does that part go on the ceiling, that top part there? Yes. Yeah.
think this is wow. obviously right. Obviously too perfect. I'm gonna start with this one because I don't know where to put it. I need the levels here. Oh. We're like professionals or something, don't you think? Yeah, we're not done yet. <laughs> Let's celebrate yet, brother. I'm trying to lift it. That looks pretty good. Pretty sweet. Brown really pops against the red. Hello. What's up? I got stuff. What'd you get? Stuff. This looks good. This is it. We're done. You're done? I don't know if I like grouting. I've done it once. I don't think I need to do it again. But my whole kitchen. Aren't you going to help me with my house? I'll supervise. That's actually good. I was worried the red would be like a really orange red. Let's see if it works. Oh, it's gonna work. Yeah, that's perfect, bro. Yeah, it's cute. I like it. <laughs> How come you get to do this? Do you want to do it? No, it's okay. Mm -hmm. just, I just want everybody to know that I can. Ready to try? I know you can. I'm now afraid I'm gonna get zapped. The, I know we turned it off. We turned it off. I know. Yeah! Sorry. That was okay. aggressive! With our light installed, I know there's still a few more things that we need, so let's head into town. I'm definitely on the lookout for some plants and pots, as well as a rug. I do not know why we always do this to ourselves, but of course we're rushing around, like, 5 o'clock, things close at 5.30, 5. It's 34 degrees. It's too hot. We need big pot. Big pot? Big pot? Big blue pot. Ooh, extra big blue pot. Ooh. <gasps> well, we found faux bamboo. Guess how much that is? $300. Not doing it. Not doing it. Kinda ugly, but could fit, fit where that gap is under the sink. Last stop for the essentials. Shopping is done and we're all back at the family cottage nearby to relax for the night. Cheers. Do it. Three, two, one. Ah! Oh. It's not bad. That's oh, great. Yeah, it's warmer at night. Morning. Okay. I think today is the last day we have to work on this. If you want to get started thinking on that open shelving for the kitchen um, with that live edge wood that we sourced, that'd be amazing. And then I know we're still missing a tabletop for this table that you guys are sitting on right now. I will take a look at figuring out something for that. Cool? Sounds good. You can go above this sink, like here, right? Yeah, that looks pretty good, actually. What if we make this one like this height? Mm -hmm. Then the other one will be like this height. Yeah, I like that. I hope this sounds all cool. Yeah, 
Yeah, that looks great. Do you remember what height that was? Did you mark it with a pencil? Hold up. <laughs> what are you doing? Trying to get the black off. That would look nicer in my opinion. It would. Crush, destroy. No, I'm not weak enough. Wait, what? Hmm? <laughs> no way. How's that work so well? Yeah? Wow. Oh, that's good. I didn't want it too big that you like couldn't see the barrel, you know? Yeah, no, this is great. This would fit two plates perfectly. Okay, what color do we paint it? Do we paint Same it? Same color as this trim. Okay, I am starting off today on a slightly tired note, but I'm excited because I think most of the space is gonna get finished today. I'm gonna start off today with a little project. It involves using the Instax MiniLink 2 smartphone printer. We've been having some fun with it while on the trip, including printing a video. Let me explain, but it is the perfect idea for my guest book, aka guest experience. Yes, I'm doing a guest book, but, but let me tell you more. The Instax MiniLink 2 has a bunch of new features that allow us to be as creative as we want with our photos, including choosing customizable frames, as well as adjusting the color of my picture, which can totally transform the mood of the photo. Yesterday, we hit up a local winery because we are in wine country, and Becky took a photo of me, but it is not just a photo. We actually recorded a video that we can share as a printable QR code on the print and then the QR code can be scanned to view the video, download the video, or share on social media. I'll hold this up and see if you guys can scan it for yourselves to watch this video. Okay, and lastly, you should know about the Instax Air feature, which allows me to draw in the air and then print those effects directly onto the photo. Elliot, Elliot, can you help me demonstrate? We can add graphics like bubbles, petals, neon, spray paint, or glitter by pressing the feature button on the top and aiming the side LED to draw in the air. What is drawn in the air will then appear on the print preview in app. And once I'm happy with the look, the graphics will appear on the print itself. I printed this one on the mini spray art film, which has rainbow spray as well as some reflective elements. And I'm putting this at the front of the book because this is unit seven, represent. So I'm going to leave behind an Instax mini link too, as well as some additional films so that future guests can leave their own recommendations and memories in the guest book. I think this is such a cute, smart idea, and I'm really excited to see what Becky does for her guest experience. But in the meantime, I gotta get working on this makeover. So for the custom wine barrel table we're building, we figured out that the bar stool chairs are too high, regular kitchen chairs are too low. So of course we got a DIY solution here. <laughs> it looks good. Wow. This no is... wobble action. Let me see. That is perfect. How'd we do that? We're good at our job, man. This isn't my job. You're good at helping me with my job. <laughs> okay, do it again. <laughs> How do I do that? Hello? Hello? Oh, hi there. I was looking for um, about a 24 inch circle piece of some kind of stone. I'm not too picky. Is there any way I could get that today? <laughs> uh, our facility is in campus. I'll give yeah. them a ring. All right, thank you so much. I love when you call a place and they give you recommendations if they can't help you. Right, we can't do it today by any chance. All right, thank you. What do I do? She said I could have it in November. Oh my God. Okay, I also stopped and asked Annalise if she has a piece of marble because I wouldn't be surprised if she had it somewhere here or if she knew of somebody that would have one because she just knows a little bit of everything. She said there might be one at the cottage that we're actually currently staying at, the family cottage. We'll see. She said she might try to find it for me. The table saga continues. Annalise had a whole pile of handles. I picked out these ones because they have a blue detail on them. I think I'm gonna use these on the cabinet that's in the corner there. And then these gold ones are really cool. I'm gonna replace the black ones that are in the kitchen because gold is just more of the vibe. Hi, 
I interrupt this handle installation for some messages from Annalise. Where, how did she find this? I called like everywhere and she's like, I have a circle 30 inches, let's go. Thank you, Annalise. That'll work perfectly. I was thinking about that. What were you thinking? Put some screws underneath that just rest inside of the barrel. Well, you can take it off, but it won't slide side to side. Huh. Okay, believe it or not, I think it might be time for final touches. Oh my God. It's really stuck. He needs my help. But final touch time slash figure out where all this decor goes. Does she have my marble table? Adhere it. It's pretty sick. Okay, uh, it's like a thousand degrees in here. Probably like 38 Celsius. How are you hanging in? Talking to me or them? You. How They're are probably you? sitting in air conditioning right now. <laughs> probably having a great time while we're melting. One of the things we were tasked with doing is leaving some sort of like thing for the guests, like a guest book or something that uh, Annalise can use for her guests. So we have found a chalkboard. I feel like chalkboard is like the most old timey way of relaying information that there is. So we're gonna hang this. Also, it works as double duty because this unsightly electrical panel here that's we want to cover anyways. And they didn't have this back, back no, in the day? Certainly not. And then the idea is that um, either guests can sign their name when they stayed or Annalise can write any like welcome information. Higher? Uh, well, I need to see the chalkboard in place. Lower? I can't tell by a nail. Can you lift the chalkboard? Please, sir? I think go more to the left. As left as you can that still covers the electrical panel. Do you want a pencil or are you good? Uh, we don't need pencils. They didn't have pencils back in the day. I kind of think they did. It needs to go one alligator tooth to the left. That looks straight? No, no, other way. You said to the left. Yes, sorry. No. <laughs> okay, why don't you point in the direction you want me to move the chalk? You move. I know what I, I move. move. I'm moving for you. You're the one that's going to move. Mm-hmm. Hey? Oh. Ah. Actually, I want it moved a little uh, bit to the left. Stop. Fun fact, you have to prime the chalkboard before the first time you use it, or else the first thing you write is going to stay on it forever. Did you know that? I did not know that. Okay, who's ready to get their hands dirty? Whoo! It's an arm workout. Ta-da! A usable looks, chalkboard. Looks great. You learned your lesson one time by uh, writing something on a fresh chalkboard. I think there's a few more things I need to grab before we can actually finish this thing, and the thrift store closes like right now. <laughs> Classic! So let's go for a walk, please. So while I was busy with something else, Elliot decided that he really wants to use this corner unit he found earlier as a dish and glass storage beside the fridge. Since it doesn't currently fit beside the fridge, he's swapping the fridge with a smaller one that he found on the property. Put a fridge in. What do you think? It's not, I know it floats. <laughs> And there's a big gap, but we're gonna put a plant up there. But at least there's somewhere to put cutlery now. This is where everybody Wait. always gets concerned over function or over form or whatever. Form over function? You know what I mean. This like, is my function. This is a little bit more functional than like aesthetic. The white fridge was more aesthetic. If you're doing a vacation stay, how big of a fridge do you need? Like okay, well, let me see if I can decorate this and make it look good. Paint it green. Oh, yeah.
That looks like hotel, right? Better than hotel. <laughs> you know what this is called, Austin? Karate chopping a pillow? Pretty much, actually, yeah. You don't need so many pillows. All, everyone's always got 30 pillows. Nobody uses them. There we go. Appropriate amount of pillows. Okay, found this um, quilt at the thrift store, but can we just take in how perfect of a match it is with our half-painted wall? Okay, I have a DIY project in mind for one of the biggest pieces in this gallery wall we're doing, but I do want to get the gallery wall all up and sorted before we do that. Just because, I don't know, it'd be nice to feel like we got that done and then I can come back in and just add the final touch to that one thing, so. Okay, so at the start of this whole project, I found a big box of rope, which I thought we could use somewhere, and I think I figured out the best way to use this. Um, these will act perfectly as nice curtain ties for all the curtains that we hung. Also add the kind of like Western theme into this a little more. So I'm gonna cut these all, knot them all, and then just cute little ties. Teamwork makes a dream work. She cute, just like you. <laughs> Okay, I just saw uh, Kelsey and Elliot reject this little table. I don't think they're using it. I think they snagged it at the beginning when we were sourcing stuff. I know it's broken and that's probably why they didn't want to use it, but I think we can fix it. And I'm just feeling like we've got this little shelf on the wall here that's great for this side of the bed, but I feel like something's lacking right here if you're on this side of the bed. I think this would be perfect and really on theme for us to go right here for this person's phone and water. So maybe I'll task Austin with fixing this leg and that will be great. Well, Austin, yeah. remember how you said that your skill was being able to fix anything? Okay. You wanna put the- Oh, I can't fix that. You wanna put the leg back on it? It's broken. Well, I know, but that's why it needs fixing. We have the other piece. I don't know about this one, Tony. <laughs> It. No way. That's amazing. Holy. No warranty though. Look at you, so talented. Wait, that's perfect. Are you kidding? And it's so on theme. And it's just like, it doesn't take up too much space. It's exactly what you need. Um, thanks Kelsey and Elliot for not using that. <laughs> Your expertise might be like fixing things and building things. But now, we gotta style this place. You think you're up to the challenge? I thought we did style it. That's what we've been spending all this time doing. Well, the gallery wall looks great, but I'm seeing a lot of empty shelves behind me. They look great. <laughs> the minimalist in you is showing. No, here's what I got. I got a whole box of cups. Let's get to making this looking good. We're done for today. <laughs> you called it? Yeah. We have stickers to get off bowls, a couple more things to pull together, a little bit of tidying to do, but Close. we did it. Mostly. It's like hard to remember where we started because there because it's there's been a long journey. I'm so curious to see Becky's unit. Okay, we're melting. Um the place looks so good. Are you are you happy with how it's looking? Yeah. Super I know, me too. I think this is the end of our day. The only thing that I have left to tackle is this mirror. Um, tomorrow we are revealing it, so I think if I get here early enough and paint this on, we'll be ready. But if not, it's not the end of the world. We'll survive. <laughs> okay, let's go back. Let's take showers a lot. Hey, look what I found. Who left this here? I wonder.
Okay, we're here. It's the final day. It's the day we reveal to Annalise. I'm so curious to see what she thinks of our themes. Mm -hmm. And I'm so excited to see your unit. I haven't seen anything. I know. I don't know what, what you guys have been doing either. And we've been wondering, so. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure you've seen like the things come in and out of my unit. Yeah. The giraffe. Still don't know if that'll stick. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we have an hour until she's back to see the rooms. You think you can pull yours together by then? Yeah, I just have a couple more things to do. Okay, I got some work to do. <laughs> So Annalise calls her rental units the South Side. So I think for the name on the mirror, we're gonna go with the South Side Saloon. Also, that just sounds really nice. South Side Saloon. And then a paint marker, which is supposed to stick to mirror once we've committed to the design. <sighs> Normally, if I was at home with all my materials, I would probably use some sort of like vinyl cutter to cut out a thing and then paint it that way. But since I'm limited here, we're just gonna freehand it and hope for the best. I mean, that's how they would do it back, back in old times anyways, right? I know it's really hard to see through the mirror, but I think we're ready for paint. Guys, I've got the biggest hand cramp going on, but ah! I, this is so much better than I thought it would be. Like, this just looks so legit already. This is exactly like that SpongeBob episode where he takes forever to just write the, and it's really fancy, but this looks so good. Okay, yeah, that's perfect, I think. Yeah, I like that. Oh, excuse me, sir. Are you ha happy with yourself? Yeah, I'm a natural. But now it looks, I don't know, it's a little... It's too busy, we gotta put it back on the post. No, I don't want it anywhere. Oh. On your head. Okay, got my hair tied up though. Okay, this is where we are. Um, I cannot feel my hand, but it's looking amazing. <laughs> so I've got a black paint pen for the shadow, and this should actually be pretty easy to do because when you stand to the side of the mirror, you can see the shadow that the paint creates in the mirror, and I'll just trace that. I think it's done. What wow, do you think? Looks, looks great. Well, that is the last of everything that I had to do. I think it looks pretty done yeah, in it here. It looks pretty good. You like it? You're happy? Happy. I think we hit the vibe we were going for. Without being, without being like too cheesy, I yeah. don't think. Shall we leave? Let's roll. Okay. <laughs> it is time. Are you excited to see your unit? I am so excited. Are you nervous at all? Extremely. Because <laughs> of all the commotion that's been going on. I did see red paint cans and that made me a little bit nervous, but it's a nice color red. So I don't know who used it. Are you yeah. ready? I think I'm, I'm up ready. first. I'm ready. Okay, let's go. I haven't seen what you've done either. Can I come with? Okay, double reveal. Let's go. Woo. Okay, come on in. Eyes closed. You too, Becky. <laughs> okay. I never get reviews. I know. This is a big day. It's so exciting. Okay, hold on. I'll set you guys up. Three, two, one. <gasps> wow. Come up with these ideas. Oh, this is beautiful. I see what you were cutting tiles for now. Tile looks yeah. amazing. Oh, look at the handles too. Do you recognize these? I do, yeah. That's so smart. Yeah. I really like that. And the that. blue, yeah, the blue. I like the blue paint. Yeah, it's a subtle pop. And I like that you didn't do a shelf in here. 
Like you just did this. <laughs> yeah, that was Ellie's idea. There's so many things to look at, Kelsey. It's beautiful. You did a great job making really it feel big nice. in here. I love it. Oh boy. Ah, oh, the pressure's oh, on. on. I know this Austin's dying to see it. Can we bring the boys in? Yeah, bring the boys in. So, what do you think? I love it. Wow, this is nice. It's just, it's amazing the difference. It does give like a tropical kind of feel. Look at this, the little bookshelf. That's yep. really nice. There's the guest book there with the Instax. Oh! Wow, this is fantastic. You ready? I don't know. This is pretty nice. It's gonna be hard to beat. <laughs> You're gonna try. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Check it out. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. <yeah>. Oh <laughs> my goodness. I love it. Yeah, this was a DIY project, hand painted. The, I like the lantern up there too. That oh, yeah. was Austin's idea, so you have to tell him that. That's a yeah. cool spot, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I love oh. your ties. Thank you, thank you. Red things. I like it, I really like it. I was not imagining this at all. I was thinking of a whole wall or something accented in red. and So this is beautiful. It, yeah. I see it ties in nicely over there. Yes, come check yeah, out the bedroom. Uh, this is beautiful. Yeah, and I like this. Yeah, it's like a little vanity. Yeah. Yeah. That's the other half plays the guitar where you put your makeup on. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Sounds exactly like Austin and I. Oh. And the lights. Like, where did you find these things? This was, I think, a $5 find, the wow. thrift store. I got a $5 light too. Mm. Really nice, Becky. Oh, thank you. Well, yeah, let me bring Austin Kelsey. in. Thank he, you. He'd love to yeah. hear it too, because he put a lot of work into this as well. I'll grab the voice. Whoa. Oh my God, I love the mirror. <laughs> Interesting. I understand now why that, it was taking so long. That yes. took me all morning and an hour. He's like, it might take me an hour, it might take me four. I don't really know like, what is yeah. going on. It's got a nice western vibe to it though. Mm -hmm. Really uh, upscale. I really like so. the, the shelf heights. Like, so unique, you know, to, yeah. layer, to layer them like that. It's just a completely different feel. Like this one is mm -hmm. more of an experience of, whoa, we're going to have a good time here and the other one is more zen and comfortable mm -hmm. of let's just relax. This one I, I think is more party. Party, yeah. <laughs> it seems like it's more of a an entertainment suite. Yeah. If that makes sense. You just want to like grab the hat off the wall and take some photos, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's a good yeah. This couple versus couple makeover challenge was so much fun, but I need to know from you guys in the comments below which base would you rather stay in? Which couple was the winner in your opinion? Tell us all your thoughts below. And also, just a reminder, we're now streaming weekly on Twitch and we would love to hear your thoughts and chat more about this video over there. All the information to our Twitch is in the description below. If you like this video, make sure you check out the time Elliot and I made over a unit at Annalise's property for the first time. We will link that here. Oh, no. This is where we find out if our relationship sinks or swims. Okay, go for it. <gasps> oh, Kelsey!